Smack. <gasps> What's, What's wrong, wrong Jakey Jake Pony? The angel of God spake unto me in a dream. Spake? Mm, no, not right now. He said, Arise, get thee out from this land, and return unto the land of thy kindred. What does that mean? I don't know. Uh, road trip? Yeah, road trip. But first, uh, let's have some sex. Oh, yeah. And he rose up that night and took his two wives and his two women servants and his eleven sons and passed over the four Jabak. And Jacob was left alone. Well, it seems everyone has successfully crossed the brook. Now I shall cross, too. And there wrestled a man with him. <laughs> until the breaking of the day. You know, we've been wrestling for so long now that... Uh, it's just getting weird. That sounds like loser talk. Well, I think it's safe to say that I'm winning here. And when he saw that he prevailed not against him, he touched the hollow of his thigh. Ow! The hollow of my thigh! Uh, I, uh, I think it dislocated it. Oh, boo-hoo. Okay, that does it, old man. Let me go, for the day breaketh. I will not let thee go, except thou bless me. All right, all right, you're blessed, you're blessed. Thy name shall be called no more Jacob, but Israel. For as a prince hast thou power with God, and hast prevailed. And he blessed him there. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Not only did I trick you into blessing me before, but now I just kicked your ass and made you bless me again. Well, um... Hey, hey everyone, I have seen God face to face, and my life is preserved. More so. Again? Blah, blah, blah. You don't have to be a dick about it. Oh, shut up, God. Whoa! Damn, I love life. Therefore, the children of Israel eat not of the sinew which shrank, which is upon the hollow of the thigh, because he touched the hollow of Jacob's thigh in the sinew that shrank. Who wrote this crap? Hey, shut up, narrator. Ah, uh, yes, Lord Master Jacob. <clears throat> That's better. Did you enjoy that? Of course you did! And now the entire first season of Messed Up Bible Stories is on DVD! With all new wraparound video tying all the stories together in a non-stop 50-minute movie version! Yay! Shut up. It is good! Unbelievably Messed Up Bible Stories, the movie. Own it on DVD.